Hello my cookies, welcome back to a new video from yours truly where we have news, reviews, and other gaming jewels. In today's video, we're going to be reviewing Red Dead Redemption 2, a game that I've had in my backlog for a while now, and I've wanted to review, so better late than never. I've had a lot of games to review ever since the release of Red Dead Redemption 2, and now I'm going to give it the spotlight it deserves. Red Dead Redemption 2 initially released on consoles on October 26, 2018 and came to PC over a year later on November 5th. The amount of hype was like no other, and it wasn't just me and my brother, seemingly everyone wanted it. Rockstar did a fantastic job creating hype for the game with its many trailers. The possibilities of what you can do in it seemed endless. Everything from the interactions to the scenery all looked like they were under a thousand layers of realism. I simply remember waiting for each trailer with much anticipation. During my playthrough, I went from feeling feelings of wonder and discovery, to then being confronted with heart pumping action. Rockstar focused on realism so much that to this day, it's still criticized for having interactions that are too realistic. This game is not for the faint of heart, because even skinning an animal has an extreme amount of realism to it. Equipped with your eagle eye and the best weapon for the job, you can hunt any animal you wish to hunt, and sell them for the best price all the while fluidly interacting with all the people you see. Simply put, this is a video game world unlike any other that I've ever seen. Speaking of what you'll see in this game, Red Dead Redemption 2 is a sight for sore eyes. I envy anyone that has yet to lay eyes on this beauty, and I'm willing to bet any amount of money that no matter who you are, you will be impressed. Even on PC with top notch hardware, running it in 4K with ultra settings will not yield the best frame rate. This is a great example of a game that you want to play even more when the next generation of graphics cards come out. While I could talk about every little detail that makes this experience an amazing one, that would make for a very long video, so I'll just give you an overview. Let's start with the world overall. Rockstar created a game so true to its time period that you often feel like you've traveled back to the late 1800s. Simply take a stroll down Valentine and you'll feel as though you're in your favorite western movie. If not that, then turn on your cinematic camera while riding on your horse. I find it hard to complain about graphics when a game looks this good. It also goes without saying that the music is absolutely astounding. From beginning to end, your ears will be overjoyed, and that's all I have to say about that. If there's one thing I can complain about, it's the online. While I hate to have to complain about anything regarding this game, I have to say that the online very much disappointed me. I've pretty much given up on the online. The first few months of me playing were just awful. With almost nothing to do, I was almost forced to quit. We did have some fun during our first playthrough, but quickly got bored of it. We plan on giving it another chance sometime soon, but those are my thoughts on what I played in late 2018 and early 2019. Despite all that I've just said, I'm glad that Rockstar focused their attention on the single player, as the end result is a masterpiece of a story. Although the online disappointed me, the overall package far exceeded my expectations. In conclusion, should you get this game? The answer to the simple question, and I can't stress this enough, is absolutely. I'd hate to be someone who'd miss out on this wild wild western ride. I was conflicted on whether to give this game a 9 or a 10, but although it's so close to perfection, the online holds it back, so I'm afraid I have to give this game 9.5 cookies out of 10. And that concludes this video. If you enjoyed this video or want to see more, make sure you hit the like and subscribe button. If you're feeling generous, make sure to hit the notification bell so that you get reminded when my new uploads come out. If you have any thoughts or constructive criticism, make sure to leave it down below and I'll be happy to respond. Anyways, thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed this cookie, and I'll see you all next time.